athletes are able to make their long-awaited return to the gym because as of Friday, our area entered phase two, which means gyms are able to reopen with certain restrictions. For a lot of people, this is a huge outlet for therapy, stress relief. Everyone's just so excited to get a part of their lives back. One of our members said they felt like a little kid on Christmas. I had a couple people in tears just walking through the door, so it's been pretty special. While gyms are open again, there are many restrictions that must be put into place. Only 30% of capacity is allowed, equipment must be cleaned and disinfected after each use, and signage with health reminders is required. At Waring's Gym, they have their customers sign up online for certain time slots. We give you about an hour or so and we shut everything down and clean and disinfect and get ready for the next group to come in. Facilities are also expected to screen patrons for COVID-19 symptoms prior to admission. You had to stop in by the front office. We do have a checkpoint where we take your uh, your temperature. We have a thermometer gun. We take a shot of Germex. We give you your own personal rag and we give you your own personal spray bottle. And that's going to be yours to, uh, to use throughout the gym. And we have spaced out 10 feet markers all the way through the gym to kind of give you an idea of where you need to be for your social distancing. And gym goers will gladly accept added precautions if it means returning to their routine for the first time in months. As a former athlete, just being here as much as I've been in my life, it's just back to routine. You know, I think everybody wants to find those routines to get back to just what they're used to. And their wait is finally over. In Virginia Beach, Megan Plain with the Chevrolet Sports Report.